Welcome back, everyone. There's a Valley girl who's making sure nobody goes cold at night. Her name is McKenna, and she's been collecting coats for the homeless for the last four years. And this year, well, no exception here. Cameron is getting a firsthand look at how it's all coming together. What an inspiring little girl. We could all learn a lesson from her. Yes, well, this is a young woman because Hillary Clinton better watch out because she's a businesswoman, she's a politician, she is doing her thing. So this is a name, McKenna Bread and Goodrich. Keep write that down because you're going to be hearing about it for the next couple of years already. She's got these 1,300 coats, which she's simply donating to people in the Valley who need it the most. She is 14 years old, and right now, yes, she should be in school. She's got some finals that she's got to do, but she's handling business right now because we're trying to help people of the Valley. How did you come up with this idea to uh, donate these coats every year? Um, I was watching a news broadcast and it um, showed homelessness just across the country and I thought I could do something to help Phoenix. Every year um, you deliver, you don't, don't, you collect is the word I'm trying to say. You collect these coats throughout the community. How do you do that? Um, I, this year is the first year businesses have been partnering with me to help. So thank you to all of them. And then my community, um, they have passed them out or like gave them to me. I've had coats at my doorstep. Um, people have just reached out to me through my Facebook and email um, saying they have coats to donate. A lot of people in the neighborhood know you as the red wagon girl because the wagon right here, this uh, red flyer, the old classic, is seen around the neighborhood towing coats, bringing them back home to the garage here. Um, what is it, I'm very impressed with you and what it is you do. What is it ultimately in life that you want to do? Um, I want to become a prostitute prosecuting attorney. All right. We all, we saved it there. Nice go. <laughs> a prosecutor, you want to be a prosecuting attorney and um, everything about you that you do involves helping other people. You are on your school student council. You're doing this. Why do you want to help people? Um, why not? We can all do something to help our community that takes very little effort, but it can help so many people while doing it. It's like humanity. We're helping others while doing very little. All right, you're do you've been doing this for four years now. I know you're gonna you're gonna probably already start like next week collecting for next year for people who are watching. How can they connect with you if they're around here and they've got some coats and they want to give them to you? Um, we have a Facebook page, McKenna's Coats for a Cause, or you can reach out to our email, McKenna's Co Coats for a Cause at gmail.com. All right, she's going to need coats, and you're donating all of these this Saturday, right? Yes, at the Phoenix Rescue Mission this Saturday. All right, help her keep a good thing going because this is amazing. Like I said, watch out for her name because she already is somebody, but she's going to be somebody big. This is a name we're going to know all across the country. Here in this magnificent warehouse of coats for young people who are going to keep them warm coming up very soon here in the Valley. I'm Cameron Riddle for Arizona's Family. She is inspiring. Love it. Thank you so much, Cameron.